Okay, we are back with some more Xenoblade Chronicles X shenanigans. Though I may have to switch over the game capture because, yeah, we were most recently doing things like Elden Ring. So there we go. Switch over to game capture with Xenoblade Chronicles X. I hope the audio is okay for it. We'll find out as we get into it. What were we doing? Um, I'm venerable, you do got some Mario Kart skills though. Well, I do appreciate it, Mythic, and same to you there. Yeah, so anybody tuning into just the Xenoblade Chronicles X stuff right now, we just finished up doing a session of the first set of new courses in the Mario Kart 8 booster pack. Booster pack, booster pass, whatever the heck it's called. It's called something like that, essentially. Uh, and it was actually pretty fun. We were doing that for about the past two and a half hours. And yeah, it was a, it was a, it was a fun time. Does this seem laggier than I, uh, does the frame rate seem choppy? It seems like behind. Hold on. 27 FPS, 30 FPS. Am I losing my mind? Hmm. I have tried playing this in 60 FPS before, and I can try enabling the uh, 60 FPS again. I have had some issues with 60 FPS before. Maybe I've just been playing a bunch of 60 FPS games recently, and I'm losing my mind seeing this is like 30 FPS or something like that. Um, because I can put the... Uh, here, here's the 60 FPS thing, Rob. I might have to restart it, though. I'll restart. We'll briefly try 60 FPS. Is what we shall do. Um, but yeah, I could feel like low frame because of 60 FPS Mario Kart 8. Delight. Yeah, maybe that's all it is. We can try putting this into 60 FPS here. But the reason why I've been doing 30 FPS in Xenoblade Chronicles X up until this point is because uh, it seems that the game's speed is tied to the FPS. So, a lot of the time, my FPS would fluctuate between anywhere from 50 to 60 FPS, which is a good FPS, but if the game speed is tied to it with, you know, 60 FPS being normal speed and 50 FPS being slower, then the whole game feels like you're, uh, you know, running through water, essentially, like you're being slowed down. And whatnot. Resume? Wait, what? What do you mean? I'm so confused what you... What you mean there? But anyway, <laughs> welcome, welcome, regardless. Oh, resub, not resume. You may have to refresh, is what you may have to do to get a proper alert in chat. So, yeah. So it's like running through water if it can't achieve the perfect, like, 60 FPS is the thing. I'm surprised my computer can't. This is being run on a 3070. Yeah, it probably just feels slower because of, you know, playing the 60 FPS Mario Kart 8 Deluxe for the past two and a half hours is probably all it is. We're just gonna go ahead and do that. Yeah, refreshing is the refreshing is the way to go. I appreciate the resub there, Lollipop, for four months now. Welcome back to Team Enharmonic. Enjoy another month of the emotes and the sub badge. I, I appreciate the continued support and whatnot. But yeah, um, <laughs> yeah, Switch may not be the best console, but it is still pretty. It can still achieve some pretty nice stuff in the right hands with those that take the time to, uh, make stuff dedicated for it, for sure. It is also the case. Yeah, so... Ha ha ha, that fixed it. <laughs> yeah, so that was probably just me losing my mind because of, you know, 60 FPS Mario Kart for so long. It's probably all it is. So we gotta play this in 30 FPS, which is the way that it would be played on a Wii U anyway. So it's no big, no big deal. Yeah, the new Kirby will be fun, though. Will be very fun. Yeah, it feels choppy. But this is probably the way that I've been playing it this whole time, and... Unless something else is slowing down my computer. Am I actually losing my mind? Do I have Meranium to give to this guy? I don't think I do, do I? I probably need to give you Meranium. Um, huh. So what do we want to do today? What do we want to do today is the qu Yeah, this feels... Is this the way that I've been playing the game all the way up until this point? Or is it just Mario Kart messing with my head? Because this feels off. Maybe I'm losing my mind. Maybe I'm going absolutely crazy. I don't know. Um, let's have a look-see here. Are there any of these that I want to do here? Is it smooth 30 FPS or lower? I don't know. Let's check here. 30 FPS. It's not dipping from it, apparently. I have to exit full screen to be able to see it. 30.03 FPS. 30.05 FPS. Yeah. 30.3 FPS. Yeah, it's sticking at 30. According to the, uh, according to the software here. Apparently. Smooth 30 FPS is fine, but once it starts dipping and varying, it's annoying. Yeah, that can definitely get very annoying then. For sure. I do know that for the next story mission, we do have to do some affinity missions. I think this is a... 
Was this one of them? I think that was one of the required affinity missions. So maybe we should go ahead and do that. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and do this then. Sure. That's how we'll start out today's session of uh, Xenoblade Chronicles. Well, I don't have to turn off the Doogie Camp of Xenoblade Chronicles X shenanigans. Wait, was it this one? I don't know. We're doing it anyway. Colonel, you haven't seen Lau around, have you? Not recently, no. Did you two have plans? Not plans, so much as a mission we were supposed to handle together. And he stood you up? Ah, oh, that's so tacky. <laughs> Can't really argue with that. Still, I'm sure he had his reasons, so try not to be too harsh on him, all right? Wait, what? Why are you defending the guy who stood you up? Uh, another fair point. Uh, you are such a weirdo. What's the deal? Why are you so protective of Lao anyway? We go way back. We were in the same unit before serving under the Colonel. Wow, that long? Yep. I was a scout. He was a sniper. We fought all over the world before the Coalition government formed. Man, I bet there are some stories there. Yeah. Not sure I want anyone hearing. Hey, Elma, what do you think? Maybe we can help Doug out since Lao was a no-show? I certainly don't mind. Is it something we could manage? Oh, well, sure. It's nothing that requires a Pathfinder specifically. If you all want to help, I'd gladly take it. Okay, then, Tatsu on the case. Doug can rest easy. Close comrades. Alrighty. I may also go into the volume mixer really quickly and turn it up a smidge. This is what I think I'll do. Oh, I need to turn up my overall volume. It's already a... As loud as it's getting there. It looks a little bit quiet in OBS. Uh, it took on a Pathfinder task with Doug in place of Lau. In place of good old Lamau. Had to knock to Lamau and investigate. Okay. Sure. Let's do that. That's reassuring. We're heading to Noctilum? Right. Three days ago, we started picking up scattered UM responses in the area. These are the spots. Problem is, we can't run our usual analysis through FrontierNet. So you want us to go check them out in person? Exactly. If you can take these three, my team will handle the others. Sounds like a piece of cake. We'll get in touch once we've gathered the data. That'll be perfect. Thanks. HQ is offering a reward, of course. But either way, drinks are on me once you're done. Uh, you better know a good place. You'd really prefer cash? Uh, sure better know a good place. Kidding? Of course I do. Just leave it to me. He'll be looking forward to it. All right. Well, I guess we're heading over to Noctilum in that case to check out this stuff. This is what we shall do. So I guess we'll start here and then go around like this way. Is probably the play. Probably. Sounds pretty good to me. Right? So, where's my scale? I guess it's like, no, it's down below. But so is the thing that I need. So, down we go. Neat. Neat, neat. So, this unusual plant, huh? There's a cutscene? Seems the UM response is coming from this plant. It's this plant. It's something about this plant. That'll make more sense when we beat the game, but... <laughs> Alright, let's head to the next spot. Right. Well, there's that. The aperture exists in Xenoblade X's world. Longfall boots seem to exist. Yeah, this is the one Xenoblade Chronicles game that has no fall damage whatsoever. So, so there's that. There's no, like, fall damage boots or anything like that. But the characters in this game are robots, so they can, uh, so they can take it, I guess. Part of me is tempted to pick a fight with you, but I know I'm super underleveled. I mean, I could maybe potentially do it. I should build up some TP for the uh, beginning of this session, is what I should probably do. Just to make sure that, you know, I have some at the ready. Yeah, get out of the get out of the scale there. Just in case I do decide to take on anybody, you know, spicy spicy going forward here. It might not be a bad idea to build up some TP so that we can actually, uh... 
so we can actually use overdrive and stuff but yeah <laughs> i'm sorry to say but i can't really take i'm not really in a position where i can exactly take recommendations gosh dang it game recommendations on the channel anytime soon and by anytime soon i mean for literally years <laughs> that's what the that's what the gamecube is like around here pretty much oh i know why it might potentially be lagging i just realized i still had the stream playing over over on the left screen typically when i'm streaming games off of my capture card i'll have my stream playing on the left screen since you know my computer doesn't have to go to as much effort for streaming since the capture card does a decent bit of the work um uh, so I can typically have the stream open there as a bit of a testing screen, make sure that everything's A-OK -okay and whatnot. But if I'm playing a game on the same computer that I'm streaming from, it's better that I have that paused. So maybe that'll help make it a little bit smoother. It feels a little bit, I don't know. Maybe I'm losing my mind. Maybe I'm, uh, maybe I'm losing my mind. I have, uh, no idea. Okie doke. So, boopity bop. Building up lots of TP here. That's all I'm doing this battle for. It's just building up TP. I am very tempted to battle that big dudo. But do I really want to? I'm probably going to lose if I try. But there's a small chance I could win. Is it worth it just for, uh, you know, attempting that? Let's see here. So one is just right over here. And the other's over there. Okay. But yeah. Definitely getting a decent bit late over there. I mean, starting to get a decent bit later into the day over here as well. Unusual plant. Another cutscene, I guess. Wow, mouse cursor. Okay, we're done analyzing this one too. I'll put it up on Frontier now. Just one to go. Let's knock it out. Just one to go. Just Juan. Juan. Yeah, that's a de that's definitely a decent bit of work to be doing there. Definitely a very long day. I do wish you luck with that. I was pressing the wrong button to jump because I'm getting mixed up with other video games for whatever reason. For whatever reason. Why are these textures not loading? Okay, now they loaded. Now they have... Whoa! Up here we go. Up this way. To the last unusual plant. And then maybe I'll take on the big dudo over there. Maybe. I'll give it a big think. Right. Upload to Frontier Nav confirmed. That's the last of them. Good work. I'll let Doug know. Are you in combat? We'll be right there. Nah, nothing you need to worry about. We got it under control. Doug? Alright, listen. If you really want to help, you can pick up my last data collection point. How's that sound? Fair enough. But you better be careful. Thanks, Lynn. I'll throw in some chocolate for the trouble. Hey, I want a drink too. What? There's a cafe that makes really good cocoa. Very expensive. You think he'll be okay? I'm sure he'll be fine. Doug is a man of his word. Guys like him always fight harder when they've got a promise to keep. Sounds like the opposite of Lao, huh? That guy never keeps a promise. Yeah, no kidding. All right, let's go hold up our end of the bargain. Time to earn that cocoa. Yep. All right, one last data collection point. And yeah, it can definitely be very confusing, switching between different controller types and such. Like, when I mapped out buttons for for the sake of this playthrough, the controller that I'm actually playing on for this is this. This is what I'm playing this game with. And I was trying to decide, like, do I want to have the input switched around for A and B and X and Y as if, you know, it was actually the Wii U gamepad as I was used to playing this game with in the past. But then I decide, you know what? I'll just have like A assigned to A, B assigned to B, and I'll just get used to playing Xenoblade Chronicles X in a different way with this kind of controller. And that's what I did. I figured that would wind up being a, being the less confusing of the two, the lesser of two evils. So, I really want to try this. Where's the, uh, okay, it's right up there. Hmm. Hmm. I'm doing it. Here we go. Okay, well, here we go. I'll try. 
I'll certainly try. Well, there goes Lin Skell. That somehow doesn't surprise me. Well, I probably shouldn't have gotten that close. That sucks. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. This is actually really bad. Yeah, I may have screwed it up. I may have screwed it up. I may have royally screwed it up. Maybe. Dang it, that was not from the side. Gosh darn it. Oh, well, there goes Elma. Now it's just me. All right, let's get some TP from this like that. Oh, dang it, right as I was using Ghost Walker. Wait, it didn't even show me dying. Well, gosh darn it. If I had used Ghost Walker one second sooner, I would have lived. If only. If only. Oh, well. Oh, well. It is what it is. No big deal. I wasn't expecting to win that or anything. But. Would have been cool. Would have been really pretty cool, I must say. And now Mr. Dudo's not gone. Hmm. Maybe I'll briefly try again then. I mean. Hmm. I see my TP back up. Gosh darn it, that was from the, uh... Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. It wasn't quite from the side, was it? But yeah, I, uh... I can't stop picking fights that I can't win in this game. I can't stop doing it. See, I built my TP. I'm sorry. That's all I need to, need to do here. Yeah, maybe, maybe. I haven't used a PlayStation controller myself in 3,000 years because I haven't owned a PlayStation console in 3,000 years. That's kind of been the thing. Okay. Yeah, I get TP up. That's all this battle is for. That's all this battle is for here. I wonder if I could do an overdrive build even easier with Elmo with, like, Ghost Factory there. Like, my unit would obviously be able to do, like, the best overdrive build at the end of the day. Like, a final build. But just in the middle of the main game here, I wonder if it would actually benefit me more to be playing as Elmo rather than my character. I do wonder. I have to check what skills she has access to and what kind of things I can level up. Because I haven't exactly designed her much around an overdrive build thus far, but... If I took the time to dump into it, it could potentially be done. Um, yeah, and it would be nice overall if game controllers were cheaper. Game controllers could get very expensive and whatnot. It could well be interesting there. This control has been serving me pretty well, apart from the fact that the wireless sucks, so I use it wired. But, uh... It is what it is, I guess. <laughs> I'll try one more time. Did someone get a level up? Like a job level up or class level? I don't even know. I don't know. Um. Yeah, let's see here. I'll try. I'll try. Well, I missed the best timing for that. Unfortunate. Of course, you immediately start with the thing that does, like, multiple hits. Yep, yeah, that somehow doesn't surprise me there. Alright, spam Ghost Walker as soon as I can, whenever I can. This is what I do. Whoops, I'm bad at video games, holy crap. My goodness gracious. Come on, get to the side! Get to the side! There we go, jeez. Okay. This might be fine, but like... I'm probably gonna die with this. I've always died to every one of these types of, uh, super bosses, so... I'm just gonna be going, like, as long as it seems like I can is all I'm gonna be going for here. Please don't kill me. I shouldn't have gone for Violent Streak. I should've just popped Ghost Walker. Darn it. <sighs> Whatever. Guess we're not fighting you again. Guess we're not doing that. I'm just gonna be wasting 3,000 years if I keep on fighting you over and over again. I keep on thinking that my Ghost Walker has more decoy uses than it has. But whoops. I keep getting carried away. So over this way. Over this way is the thing we're about. Oh, right over here. This. This plant right here. Okay. Automatic cutscene. Dang it, maybe I should have built up TP for this fight instead of the big guy. Hey, 
Alma. Were there always this many indigens kicking around here? No, definitely not. I wonder if the plant is drawing them somehow. I'll start the analysis. And that's that. We're good. We may have finished the data collection. But it looks like the mission isn't over just yet. You don't suppose Doug's team... Yeah. They may be dealing with the same problem. Bring on nasty critters! Friends will teach them all a lesson! You can help out any time, you know. Yeah, I should have... Wait, did I even have my microphone unmuted? I was talking there about how I uh, turned on the wrong camera. And then I looked over my microphone was muted. I don't know if I just uh, just then muted it or if it had been muted for a little smidge. I'd have come sooner if I could. Guess this means I owe you both cocoa and chocolates, huh? You know it. Well, now I can pop overdrive, so. Oh, <laughs> let's put a uh, super low level Doug into uh, into the thing here. Well, come on, time for everything to die. I guess everything dies now. Okay. Well. Okay. Time to get a bazillion count. Okay. Well. I mean, uh, big damage. Well, everything just dies. Everything just dies. Now you're for sure dead, so I'm just gonna get a little bit of TP before the battle ends. Dang it, should've gotten a little bit more. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have used those, uh, TP arts. Oh well. Oh well, what you gonna do? These plants certainly seem to have some unique properties. No kidding. Anyway. Let's meet up in the city after I submit my report. We can split the reward, and I'll finally get you those drinks. Copy that. Be careful. Will do. Meet you at the cafe. I'll call Lau, too, so he can pony up as well. It's a date. Alrighty, talk to Lau at the barista court in the commercial district. Okay, I will go do exactly that. So, over this way. Aha! Aha! Let's go ahead and uh, go do that and wrap up this affinity mission. I think this was the one that was the prerequisite for the next chapter, right? I don't know if I want to do the next chapter immediately, if so. Just curious if this was the one for it. Well, it seems like a wonderful time of day to have, like, a coffee. Wow. Hey, Lynn. Listen. I hear you covered for me on a job. I did. And it was a ton of work, too. My bad. Look, how about I treat you to some tea to make up for it? I have a shop that sells the good stuff. Grown right here on Mira. Wow, how exotic. Okay, you're forgiven. Wait, what? That's all it took? 
Hey, maybe next time you won't try to bribe me with chocolates like some little kid. Who doesn't like chocolates? Uh, demand your own reward or ask where Lao was this whole time. Hey, what are you, a detective? I'll make it up to you as well, okay? Any word on the results of that plant analysis, Doug? Nope, nothing yet. Hmm. Well, I hope it's nothing serious. You're telling me. Not to worry. Whatever happens, Tatsu is here. And Tatsu more than happy to help friends and other pathetic sad beings who need it. There we go. Mission complete. Another affinity mission added to the list of completed ones. Investigation into the UM responses isn't quite ready, but Lin's mood improved once she was offered some tea. Neat. You learn the Photon Saber Art Starlight Duster, whatever the heck that is. 